Hey everyone! So, let's do a reading for you today. Um, we're going to check what is it that you need to move on from. Um, we're going to try and see if there are anything or if there's anything that you need to let go of in order for, you know, for you to be in a better situation. So, um, Spirit, um, for my friends today, what do they need to let go of? So, you have here the chariot in reverse. The Ten of Cups. So, alright. So this is a, well, talk about like going for the positive. You have the Page of Cups in reverse. Um, let me draw your cards muna ha. The Death card upright, the Ace of Cups in reverse, and the Eight of Swords. Okay. So, right now kasi, I think na parang there are some delays in your life. Probably you are having some opportunity um, which you do not want to take out of fear. So, if there's anything that you need to let go, especially with the Eight of Swords being here, falling under the Page of Cups, I think that if there's anything that you need to let go of, it would be your own fears and your own self-restrictions, which is why hindi ninyo nakukuha yung mga opportunities that are for you. If anything, I think that for most of you, this could be a chance of have, of having like a new love situation of have, or of meeting someone new to love, especially with the Page of Cups, Ace of Cups, and the Ten of Cups here. Probably, and for some of you, there could have been, a, there could be a situation where um, parang you see yourself with someone already. Parang you see na this, and again, this is a general reading, so only take what resonates and leave the rest. But for some of you, probably there is someone you met who you think aligns with your values, probably yung tipong pwedeng, pwede mo nang maging asawa, but then, you don't wanna go for it or you don't wanna go through it kasi you're not ready to leave yung liberty mo, yung singlehood mo. You think na parang being in a relationship would um would sort of like rob you of your independence. You have here the King of Cups, so yeah, for most of you, probably this is a love situation. Um, The High Priestess Upright, and the seven of cups back of the deck you have the seven of swords okay so for some of you or for most of you i think that this turned out <laughs> to be sort of like a relationship reading i think that for most of you hindi kayo maka move on from a past failure of a relationship especially with the seven of swords being here you could have been lied to in one instance before you could have experienced um being cheated on and then after some time with the chariot being here in reverse you sort of like got stuck in that energy where you'd like to be alone and, and there's really nothing wrong with that i think na parang sometimes us being alone or wanting to be alone is liberating we try we tend to pursue things that we want we tend to only be focused on our own self-healing but right now you're being advised especially with the king of cups the high priestess and the seven of cups here there are a lot of opportunities opening up for you. It's not just about love, but it's about finding something else to love. For example, it doesn't necessarily have to be a person. It could be na, let's say you really love drawing or you really love making art. And then for some reason, there were some people before who made fun of the art that you made just because it's abstract or whatsoever. So you sort of like stopped doing that. Now, yung fear mo na yon, um, yung fear mo na yon of being judged, of being seen as, you know, parang as, as something or as someone or whatever it is na parang you're trying to change in your situation right now. I think na parang it's more of like you not being allowed or you not being able to move forward kasi ikaw na rin mismo yung parang naging comfortable ka na with where you are. Whether this is a love situation, singlehood situation, or pursuing something else that would that you'd be passionate about you need to get over it you need to you need to kumbaga, parang, like have a rebirth of some sort from being stuck into being more in tune with how you feel and more in tune with your emotions so kumbaga parang this is really just a classic example of being too afraid to try kasi you failed the previous um the previous um, chances before. So let's see what these cards are. You have here the Hermit in reverse, the Six of Wands in reverse. Um, let's draw two more. Oh, okay, thank you. The Moon in reverse and the Tower upright. Alright, 
So, back of the deck, you have the sun. So, if you're looking for confirmation that things are going to be better for you, the moment that you decide to walk through this path of, let's say, I guess, rebirth, then yes. Um, especially with, with Leo season coming up, the sun after all rules Leo energy. Some of you could be Leos, which is probably why when things didn't go <laughs> the way that you expected, medyo na, na kumbaga parang nakina yung loob ninyo. So right now, you're being advised na you need to move forward um, from the situation in order for you to gain the benefits and the success that goes with it. Um, the Six of Wands is a very positive card. Talks about success. Talks about getting what we deserve and what we worked hard for. Again, like I said, whether this be a relationship or something that you want to pursue, be it a job, a hobby, or anything, um, you need to go out of your shell and really go forward with it. The Moon card being here in reverse and the Tower card upright. Um, either you accept the change that you're being required to go through or you will be forced to make that change. So, kumbaga parang, um, sometimes kasi we, we become stuck because it's our choice not to move forward. Pero right now, sinasabi na sa inyo na kung ayaw ninyo mag-move forward ngayon, one way or another, you will be forced to make that change. So I think that right now, the best course of action for you, my dear friends, would be to really accept that maybe, you know, you need a change of scenery, a change of situation. And with that, um, kapag ka nag-start na kayo on your journey to, I guess, um, journey on reinventing yourself, that's when you get all of the benefits. And that's when you see that there's really a brighter day ahead. And um, you're really loved na there are really a lot of blessings that are on your way. It's just a matter of you um, taking them with you. So uh, that's it for you, friends. Um, thank you so much for staying with me. Do follow me on Instagram and YouTube for more.